always the naughty boys who turn me on Always the naughty boys who turn me on Turn me on. the naughty boys who turn me on.
is that all the fucking answering machine service, I fucking had money deducted from my fucking mobile without fucking authorization. I've had to send fucking emails, fucking texts to get fucking bullshit replies. Now I have to waste fucking money bringing your fucking company fucking overseas to get a fucking answering machine and use more of my fucking money for something that is fucking bullshit. One of you cunts, read my fucking email and fucking reply. You're a bunch of fucking fuckwits. I cannot fucking tell you how fucking pissed off I am. And if I was in fucking America or Germany or England or whatever countries your fucked up offices are in, I would be walking into your fucking office right now and smashing your fucking heads in. Get the fucking picture. Resolve my fucking issue. I don't have to tell you things are bad. Everybody knows things are bad. It's a depression. Everybody's out of work or scared of losing their job. The dollar buys a nickel's worth. Banks are going bust. Shopkeepers keep a gun under the counter. Punks are running wild in the street. And there's nobody anywhere who seems to know what to do and there's no end to it. We know the air is unfit to breathe and our food is unfit to eat sit watching our TVs while some local newscaster tells us that today we had 15 homicides and 63 violent crimes as if that's the way it's supposed to be. We know things are bad, worse than bad. 
They're crazy. It's like everything everywhere is going crazy, so we don't go out anymore. We sit in the house, and slowly the world we're living in is getting smaller, and all we say is, please, at least leave us alone in our living rooms. Let me have my toaster and my TV and my steel-belted radios, and I won't say anything. Just leave us alone. Well, I'm not going to leave you alone. I want you to get mad. I don't want you to protest, I don't want you to write, I don't want you to write to your congressman because I wouldn't know what to tell you to write. I don't know what to do about the depression and the inflation and the Russians and the crime in the street. All I know is that first, you've got to get mad. You've got to say, I'm a human being, God damn it! My life has value! I want you to get up now. I want all of you to get up out of your chairs. I want you to get up right now and go to the window Open it and stick your head out and yell, I'm as mad as hell and I'm not going to take this anymore! I'm as mad as hell and I'm not going to take this anymore! I don't have to tell you things are bad. Everybody knows things are bad. It's a depression. Everybody's out of work or scared of losing their job. The dollar buys a nickel's worth. Banks are going bust. Shopkeepers keep a gun under the counter. Punks are running wild in the street. There's nobody anywhere who seems to know what to do, and there's no end to it. We know the air is unfit to breathe, and our food is unfit to eat. We sit watching our TVs while some local news just tells us that today we had 15 homicides and 63 violent crimes, as if that's the way it's supposed to be. We know things are bad, worse than bad. They're crazy. It's like everything everywhere is going crazy, so we don't go on anymore. We sit in the house, and slowly the world we're living in is getting smaller, and all we say is, please, at least leave us alone in our living rooms. Let me have my toaster and my TV and my steam-belted radio, and I won't say anything. Just leave us alone. Well, I'm not going to leave you alone. I don't want you to protest, I don't want you to write, I don't want you to write to your congressman because I wouldn't know what to tell you to write. I don't know what to do about the depression and the inflation and the Russians and the crime in the street. All I know is that first, you've got to get mad. You've got to say, I'm a human being. God damn it, my life has value. I want you to get up now. I want all of you to get up out of your chairs. I want you to get up right now and go to the window, open it, and stick your head out and yell, I'm as mad as hell, and I'm not going to take this anymore!
toss me the chain so dolly